World Economic Forum 2016 Global Information Technology Report, South Africa ranked last in mathematics and science education quality. Well, to help turn the tide, the South African Mathematics Foundation, together with Nestle South Africa, set up the Nestle Nespre South African Mathematics Challenge. Now, this challenge aims to empower learners to become more independent, creative and critical thinkers who will be able to interpret and critically analyze everyday situations in and out of the classroom. Now, to discuss this a little bit further, we're joined in studio by Pumlam Mkise. She's the senior brand manager at Nestle Nespre South Africa. Good afternoon, Pumla, and thank you so much for coming through to the SABC News Desk. Thank you for having me, Koshni. Lovely to have you with us, Pumla. Tell us how this great partnership came about in the first place. So, um, a little bit about maybe some context. Yes. You know, um, Nestle uh, is a leading food and beverage uh, organization. Um, we employ over 300,000 uh, employees in 180 uh, countries. And we're quite proud and committed to our purpose, which is um, to enhance the quality of life while contributing to healthier future. Mm -hmm. So for us, we believe that the Nestle Nespre South African Maths Challenge is all about how we can stand up um, and actually make an impact mm. um, in trying to enhance the quality of life of learners in South Africa. Uh, yes, and there has been so much of focus really on how we can improve poor mathematics performance of learners, but it really all starts with good nutrition, doesn't it, Pumla? Because there's been heightened attention also on uh, good nutrition in the first thousand days of a child's life. You know, Kirsch, a lot has been written about nutrition um, and the impact that nutrition has on cognitive development. Yes. Uh, so we are uh, firm believers that the role of nutrition, actually what we say is, it's, uh, it should be seven color Sunday meals every day. It's about a balanced diet. Mm -hmm. It's about having the right balance of carbohydrates, proteins. Um, and so we're quite proud of the fact that the product that we deliver, which is the Nestle Nespre, which is made made um, from real cow's milk um, and then adding fortification which then allows that child Kushni to have that added zinc that added iron the added B vitamins that they really need to help them um, to have to be mind and body ready for school mm -hmm. uh, how do you respond to those who advocate that breastfeeding is the right way to go Pumla and exclusive breastfeeding is the best for baby so uh, Krishni, you know, at Nestle, we are firm believers that uh, breast is best. Mm -hmm. um, we we 100% are supportive of mothers um, uh, breastfeeding. Mm -hmm. uh, of course, Nestle Nespre is not uh, for babies. Yes. It is for children, children. Yes, yes, who are aged uh, from the age of five mm -hmm. um, up to 14 years mm -hmm. old. Mm -hmm. All right. Tell us more about the Nestle Nespre South African Mathematics Challenge. How does it work? What can we expect? So the Mathematics Challenge is actually a competitive platform. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you are aware of uh, something called the Maths Olympiad. Yes. It's, that is the same uh, concept for older secondary children. So the Maths Challenge is for grades 4 to 7, and it is written in primary schools across the country. To date, we have 80,000 learners who are participating, mm -hmm. and together with our partner, the South African Mathematics Foundation, we're really hoping that we can encourage parents, that we can encourage children, to participate in this challenge um, so that we will be able to help them to get the necessary skills that they need uh, to be future leaders in the country. Uh, how does the challenge work exactly? How do schools get involved? Do they register or do parents go online and register their kids or do we leave it to the teachers? So to date, um, we do an extensive communication uh, through the, our partner, the South African Maths Foundation, mm -hmm. supported by the Department of Basic Education. And uh, the teachers, the mathematics teachers, are the ones that nominate their children and the children then enter via the South African Maths Foundation for the challenge. Uh, and in future, we're hoping that through our partnership, um, so Nestle Nespre, together with the South African Maths Foundation, we can actually create more visibility 
quality so that both learners and teachers as well as parents I think Christian the thing is really parents play a big role um, mm -hmm. in encouraging children I don't know I mean when I was in high school primary school mathematics was always that tough subject mm. that everybody speaks about so we, we are we are counting on parents to be supportive of their children so that they can also enter and pick up their hand and, um, and in the schools. counter sometimes that aversion around mathematics 100%. that we see come to Indeed. the fore in the classroom uh, tell me uh, how will the learners then themselves benefit in terms of prizes or are schools how are schools going to be uplifted at the end of the challenge so there is, of course, a prize money towards the end. Mm. But I think for us, if I take a step back, mm. the one thing that, uh, to, as Nestle Nesbury, that we bring uh, through partnering uh, the challenge uh, or South African Maths F uh, Foundation mm. is that we bring um, the s resources that South African Maths Foundation can actually have to to provide workshops for teachers as well as learners mm -hmm. across the different provinces in South Africa. We're very proud of that fact. And uh, also this year we are creating a, a, a last and final Nestle Nespre Smart Camp where the learners get an opportunity to come to Johannesburg um, uh, with a parent where they can actually be exposed to what can mathematics actually open in terms of doors for them from a future, from a career. Yes. What is it that they can actually actually uh, get for themselves um, mm. as, as people so that they are able to be academically successful mm. in the mm. future. Uh, in terms of those teacher and learner workshops, yes. Pumla, uh, what are the shortfalls that you are coming across? Any feedback for us in terms of mathematics learning and teaching and mathematics education in the country right now? You know, um, Krishni, uh, we have made great strides as a country in terms of improving, but yeah. sadly the numbers are not yet um, tallying up to what we, we really need them to be. So of course resources are a challenge, which is why we as Nestle and Nespre, together with the South African Maths Foundation really are saying that this is something that we want to do to support the Department of Basic Education mm -hmm. in order for them to be able to do what they uh, need to do to get our learners to be um, academically ready for a success successful future. All right, for students or learners or teachers or, or uh, school principals out there who would like to join the challenge, how do they get a hold of you? So today um, they can uh, get a hold of the South African Mathematics Foundation. Um, they are a body that works uh, very closely with the Department of Basic Education. They can also be reached um, on a Facebook page, SA Maths Foundation. Um, otherwise, we will also be communicating on our Facebook page, which is Nespre South Africa, in terms of the progress that we are making um, in uh, uh, providing more awareness um, of the challenge and the mm. problem that we have in the country. Pamela, thank you so much for your time on the SABC News Desk. It was lovely chatting with you this afternoon. This is Pumla Makiza. She's the Senior Brand Manager at Nestle Nespre South Africa, joining us on the SABC News Channel. Let's move on now. One small step.